has come to our family. You remember our venerable house? Opulent and imperial, gazing proudly from its stoic perch above the moor. I lived all my years in that ancient, rumor-shadowed manor, fattened by decadence and luxury. And yet I began to tire of conventional extravagance. Singular unsettling tales suggested the mansion itself was a gateway to some fabulous and unnameable power. With relic and ritual, I bent every effort towards the excavation and recovery of those long buried secrets, exhausting what remained of our family fortune on swarthy workmen and sturdy shovels. At last, in the salt-soaked crags beneath the lowest foundations, we unearthed that damnable portal of antediluvian evil. Our every step unsettled the ancient earth, but we were in a realm of death and madness. In the end, I alone fled laughing and wailing through those blackened arcades of antiquity, until consciousness failed me. You remember our venerable house, opulent and imperial. It is a festering abomination. I beg you, return home, claim your birthright, and deliver our family from the ravenous clutching shadows of the darkest dungeon. I'm thinking he probably should not have begun those excavations. Because now, look at us. Here we are, with this crappy manor. This torn down, destroyed manor. That's all I got left. So welcome to Darkest Dungeon. This is my new uh, strategy playthrough on this channel. Now, I know Darkest Dungeon 2 has been released. And I was kind of waiting to see if I'd be interested in doing a playthrough of Darkest Dungeon 2 instead of Darkest Dungeon. Darkest Dungeon is one of my favorite games, and I've been wanting to do a playthrough of this for quite a while, um, but I was involved in some other playthroughs. Anyway, so then I thought, okay, now it's time to do Darkest Dungeon, and then Darkest Dungeon 2 was coming out, so I thought I'd wait and take a look at it. Um, it's not quite... It's not quite what I want for a playthrough. Um, the game isn't quite finished, it's not really the same type of game, I don't think. Um, there, there are a lot of uh, things that have changed in Darkest Dungeon 2. A lot of a lot of features that are just not there anymore. Um, specifically, the Hamlet. Things that I like about Darkest Dungeon aren't in Dar Darkest Dungeon 2. So I'm not going to do that playthrough right now, like everybody else is, just hopping on that. I'm, I'm just not interested. So I want to do one of these. I think this will be fun. Um, and see where this goes. Let's start a campaign. Um, I've been... This is my one I've been playing for a while. Um, but I, we're going to start a new one. Obviously. I do have a couple of DLC. I'm not going to play with Crimson Court. Um, I may... The Districts... We are going to have the Flagellant and the Shieldbreaker. Districts... We might as well leave them enabled. Um, and I'm going to go probably middle, the hard, the, the darkest um, original settings for the game. Hmm. Radiant, I think it's a little too easy. Um, let's do darkest. Kind of the middle of the road difficulty. And we'll call this, what do we want to call this? wrecked. Let's call it the uh, wrecked. And we're going to enable... Yeah, that looks correct. Hmm. 
you will arrive along the old road. It winds with a troubling serpent-like suggestion through the corrupted countryside, leading only, I fear, to ever more tenebrous places. There is a sickness in the ancient pitted cobbles of the old road, and on its writhing path, you will face viciousness, violence, and perhaps other damnably transcendent terrors. So steel yourself, and remember there can be no bravery without madness. The old road will take you to hell, but in that gaping abyss, we will find our redemption. All right, here we go. Um, I did turn off, I believe I turned off the tutorials and all that. Um, let's just get to the Hamlet, shall we? Brigands have run up these lanes. Brigands. The side path. The Hamlet has One brigand? Died. A cutthroat. We shall this kill him. In brutal fashion, that all may hear of your arrival. Got a bleed going on him. Let's see. This will probably just smash him down right now. Yep. Decimated. Decimated. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave. Let's take all that. Let's check the um, the options, the audio. I have the master volume down. I have the sound effects and music volume and all that. At a certain uh, certain volumes, I'm gonna see how that how that sounds when I'm doing my editing, and then adjust from there. It sounds okay to me right now, and but if it's off a little bit, I'll I'll I'll, I'll change that in the editing, and then make adjustments for the next episode. So the format I think I'm gonna do is probably one or two weeks per episode. Maybe it depends on how this goes. I'm going I. I will have a lot of because when I'm at the Hamlet, I like I take I take my sweet ass time like usual. <laughs> I take forever deciding who's gonna go, what mission I'm gonna go on, who's gonna go on it, who get, has to go into uh, the sanitarium this this week, who has to um, um, work on their stress, uh, and and I might. I'll probably cut some of that out. I don't know. And then I'll probably make those decisions and then show you what I'm doing just to make the episodes shorter. Um, and maybe I can fit two weeks in per episode. We'll see. We'll see how that goes. Anyway, that's what I plan to do. Take all the goodies there. Nothing unchecked. There is much to be found in forgotten places. And there will probably be, there will be a fight in here. Ambush. Send these vermin a message. Send the these right vermin. Has returned, and their kind is no longer welcome. So let's see. Dismas has pistol shot, grape shot, which I never use much. Don't use tracking shot much either. I need to give him some. Uh, does he have? He has open vein. Open vein, I, I feel, is somewhat better than wicked slice. Um. It gives a little bit of bleed, but we'll, we'll get into that a little later. Um, let's see if we can kill that guy. Couldn't kill him before he blanket fires us. Shouldn't be a problem, though. Uh, let's just smash this guy. Yeah, missed! So the last, the last game I I, I was playing, uh, the last um, campaign I was playing at the beginning, Dismas could not hit the broadside of a barn. It was ridiculous. It was like this. I had like, I think, fifteen misses in a row. It was crazy. That may be an exaggeration, but <laughs> all right. Hack! 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 Come on, Dismas, take care of him. There we Confidence go. Surges as the enemy crumbles. Ooh, good. 
don't punish us. Ooh. All right. That should do it. He's got two damage. Nah, he's nah, here. We go. Smash. Victory. Perhaps the turning point. It is the turning point. Let's see. Trap chest. Well, we're gonna open it. It's trapped. <laughs> That should be the end of it, though. Let's go to the hamlet. Okay. Dismiss Scott. Robust. Disease resist. Okay. Welcome home. Such that Such it, is. it is. Okay, Dismas and this Renal. squalid hamlet, these corrupted lands, they are yours now. Thank you. And you are bound to them. Great. I got a wrecked. I got a, a squalid, icky hamlet, and uh, and um, this thing up here of madness and morbidity. Which is in disrepair, as Your you can see. Begins. Yep. Okay, let's recruit the first two. Women let's get the Plague men, Doctor. Soldiers and outlaws. And the Vestal. Fools and corpses. All will find their way to us now that the road is clear. And we're going to want to increase the, uh, the stagecoach. We're going to want to upgrade it so we can get more heroes available. Roster, we probably don't need to increase quite Great yeah, might as well be found even here in the mud and rain and then we're going to want to start upgrading the guild and blacksmith as soon as possible trinkets and charms gathered from all the forgotten corners of the earth in time you will know the tragic extent of my failings. Yes, we will. So, the wrecked estate. That's that's. Most will end up here. The name here. Covered in the poisoned earth, awaiting merciful oblivion. He's talking about the graveyard. Okay. So let's go. Let's embark. Where do we want to go? I guess the ruins. That's the first place we're gonna go. Oops. Let's put the plague doctor here. The Vestal here. The usual suspects, of course. Voice, and I'm probably not going to rename these characters. Um, I don't really care what their names are, really. Garen and Voicen. Okay. What are we going after? The Blightstone? Okay. Minus one speed, though. Don't really care for that. So it's probably a crappy... Yeah, it's a common trinket. Uh... But it doesn't matter. Let's provision. The cost of preparedness, measured now in gold, later in, in blood. blood. Okay, one second. Okay, here we go. Um, let's see. Ruins. We're going to want. This is a short one, so let's give us probably. And I, what I typically do is I over provision because I like to be careful. Um, I'm more on the side of provisioning more and then maybe wasting a little money um, sometimes because I can always go again or um, I can always bring back a little less. It's no big deal. Um, and I'm also not afraid of running away from fights and then going back. I think it's better than having your characters die, but um, I don't do that very often. I don't really see the need to, but well, you know, that's, that's, I'm not afraid to do it if I have to, so. 12, that should be enough food. Um, we'll need a couple shovels probably. Uh, I might bring a couple bandages. One is probably enough. An herb, a key, uh, a couple holy waters, I guess, oops. And torches, probably eight. Because we're going to probably find one or two in there. And that should be enough. Let's see. I really don't need the antivenom, but the Plague Doctor brings it. Um, Twelve. Shovel manager. Key. Holy water torch. Okay, that should be good. Let's go.
be curious, be careful. We shall. Let's see. This is usually a grid. Okay. We're going to move to this room. Now, they don't have any upgrades, no trinkets, nothing. So, But this should, this should be fine. And here we go, a torch. A handsome reward for a task well performed. He performed his task so well, he reached up and grabbed the torch. Well done, Dismas. Well, way to go. First room might have a fight in it. Let's check it out. Yep, a couple of uh, bone rabbles. Who are surprised? Okay. Pistol shot that one. You know, I didn't even check. That's okay. We'll check after this fight. I, I, it shouldn't be a big deal. I didn't. I forgot to check what skills they have and which ones I want to use. But no big deal. Let's blight him. Five damage. Wow, that's nice. Um, we'll. Ooh, I don't have. Um, I don't have... What is it? I forgot what it is. The one that stuns. Well... There we go. As the enemy I probably should have judgmented this one, but... Not a big deal. This is unholy, right? There we go. Bye-bye. Unforeseen. Unforgiving. Unlock strong box. I think we can just open this one. Now, I don't have all of the uh, curios memorized. I don't have uh, a lot of other things memorized. I'm, I'm going to make some mistakes in this game. I'm not a perfect player by any means. Um, this is more of kind of a, like a fun playthrough more than anything. Um, so, don't expect to uh, be awed. <laughs> by this. Um, it's more for fun than anything. Okay, let's... Even the cold stone seems bent on preventing passage. Get rid of the rubble. Oh, okay. Let's... Um, oh, I didn't check their um, skills. Oops. We'll definitely do that next time. Five, this gets five, this is four. Let's Noxious Blast. Oh, I can't, right. Plague Grenade her. And we'll judge her too. I missed. Okay, let's shoot her. There we go. Continue the onslaught. Destroy them all. Uh, what's their 10 and 8? And this does, what, 3 to 7? Yeah, we'll do that. We'll be fine. Blight that one. That one's dead. And let's see if he can shoot this one. Yep. Another one falls. We can get some party healing. Oh, I can't. I don't have party heal. Wow. Okay. Or maybe I do. I just haven't picked it. Now let's take a look. She does not have divine comfort. Interesting. Okay. Well, we're gonna have to change that. Okay. I got some training to do with these. Hmm. When I can get the, um... When I can get that uh, one hamlet... What is it called? The uh, training facility? <laughs> we'll just call it the training facility for now. Nothing here. Okay, we can go this way or this way. I wish I had some scouting, but I don't. Let's just go up here to this room. Let's 
let's open that bag. Now he he is a kleptomaniac. Uh, he's all, doesn't he always start with klepto? I think he does. So at some point, what's this? Plague Doctor, plus eight accuracy and minus five max HP. Okay. So at some point during this run, he's gonna snatch one of these bags. It's gonna happen. Okay, let's get the, let's get uh, her. What is, oh wait. She doesn't have a... Now, I'm not... Like, I haven't memorized all of the um, skills for the enemies, but she doesn't appear to have any stress uh, skill. We're gonna... Ah, she resisted Blight. Okay, let's just shoot her. There we go. Haha. <laughs> -ha. Okay, she can... Judge... That one, I guess. And smash him down. Ooh, I missed. He's got a bleed. Okay. Let's get a bleed going on. Well, no, you know, let's see. That's. 85 95 Let's get a bleed going on him. Oh, never mind. Broken. <laughs> Maintain the offensive. Blight. Yes. 5 damage. Uh, let's give him a bandage, cure that bleed, and then smack him on the head. Executed with impunity. Give me all the goodies, and this is what I've locked. So too Heirloom chest, I think a key, right? Yeah. Wealth beyond measure. Alright. to the brave and the foolhardy alike. We're the foolhardy. Okay, let's go here. 85 torch. We have six torches left. I like to play ah uh, man. I like to play in, in light. Traps lie in wait, unsprung and thirsting for blood. Let's go in here. Nothing. Scouting. We got some scouting. Good. Okay, we have a battle down here and a curio, which we missed. We might go back for. So we have looks like two battles left. Let's go get this one. And Dismas is probably our best at traps. He 50%? I'm sure he is. Yeah. So he'll probably have an 80 to 90%. 90%. Alright. Get that light up there. Hope I find another torch. Here we go. They're surprised. Good. Let's get this... Uh, Arvalus back here. Get him in the back first. Get some blight going. I'm gonna shoot his ass. Okay, he's dead. Uh, she will... Should I just start healing? Let's heal. Renald. These are unholy, right? Okay. And eh, let's just smack him. Great is the weapon that cuts on its own. You could do better than that, right? Ooh, yeah. We can. Oh yeah, well take that. As the fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. Uh I'd like to see if I can heal Dismas. Let's Embolden. Good. Let's get a heal on him. And then maybe he'll miss. Nah, he got something on my Plague Doctor. <sighs> okay. Well. 
His speed is 10. I'm not likely to get another heal. For That's okay, I got food. Let's just smack him. Um, all right, right. What was that? These nightmarish creatures can be felled. Twenty percent uh, debuff resists. Crappy, crappy. It's worth a little bit of money. Um, this is what I forgot. What this is? Holy fountain. That's for, I think, holy water, right? Yeah. There's a chance you get stress heal, but there's a chance you get gems. So let's uh, let's, let's have her do it, just in case there it is stress heal. Okay, she got the stress heal. Alright, time to leave. Shall we go find out what this curio is? You can always come back, right? If it's a box... Oh, it's a... He's gonna... Ronald's gonna try and snatch, snatch it. I want to try and get it before he tried to snatch it. Okay. Uh, key... Herbs? I don't really think we're gonna need the herbs, to be honest. Let's dump that. And let's go back. I think we can go back and then go back in the door. There we go. Okay. Let's give them some food. We got plenty of food. Leave some for in case we have a a, a hunger check. Okay, we're going here. Uh, here's where he's going to try and snag that bag. Uh, see if I can get it first. Littering a lot of food. Trinkets and baubles. Paid for in blood. I think we can leave that. Where are we? How many torches we got left? Four? We'll light one. Hunger check. continue because we got one more we want to we want to go do this battle here definitely okay get rid of that let's make sure our torch is up bright before we enter we got one left are we ready to go it looks like we are Okay, we need to get rid of this guy, the Bone Courtier. First, he causes a lot of stress. Let's see if we can shoot him, kill him. Nah. Dismas, come on. Come on, man. Should we stun them or plague them? Oh, I don't have the stun, do I? Ugh. Alright. We got the blight on him. Uh, let's judge. Oh, I missed. Hmm. Start hacking that, that one, I guess. He's gonna throw his wine on somebody. Ugh. Wow. They didn't miss. Okay, he, he's dead. Next turn. Four. We still need to kill that one. Uh, I could I could heal. Nah. 
let's get some blight on this one. Five. Okay. Come on, Dismas. Don't miss. Excellent. Uh, let's heal Dismas. That one's dead next turn. Bye bye. Gently. This is how a life is taken. Mm. Get some blight on that one. Bye bye. Shoot him. Uh, cut him. And I don't think we need the heal, but let's do it anyway. And what is this? Is 8585. Be gone, fiend. Be gone. I, I love the narrator's voice. Be wary. Uh, June. Triumphant pride precipitates a dizzying fall. And this is what? An heirloom chest? Okay, what do we want to dump? The bandage, I guess. We don't need that anymore. Although, 15 gold. We want to keep the shovel. Those are quite expensive. Let's just dump the bandage. There we go. Okay, we're done with week one. Let's go back to the hamlet. So we got 5,200 in gold. That's about 8,000... Let's see, 24 crests. Okay. Lurker. I don't know that one very well. Minus, plus 10% damage. Eh, that one's not really useful to me. The yips I don't really care for. Okay. Tents are pitched, banners fly, and the corpse wagons stand at the ready. The circus has come to town. The circus? Okay. Yeah, we don't I don't have that, so we won't be using that. Tavern is unlocked, Abbey is unlocked. Okay, we still need more for the sanitarium. And these two. Let's see what we got in the stagecoach. We'll definitely take this. Sh we'll probably take them all. Then we'll take both of these two. Swaying. She mesmerizes her prey before the final strike. I will need another plague doctor probably, but I don't know if I want one right now. Um, I think these two for now. Pierce. Okay. Uppercut I need. Flashbang. Finish him. Okay. So we do need some training. I need to get the uh, guild unlocked. We're going back to the ruins. Uh, what is this? This is really good for the occultist. Really good for the occultist. That one's kind of meh. Her bleed isn't that great anyway, so... Uh, Arbalist... That's pretty good, also. Ooh, okay. I like that, because when I get an occultist, I'm going to use him pretty... I'm probably going to go here. Back to the ruins and the short one to get this. This trinket. So... Shall we use Renald again? Or the Shield Breaker? She's got Pierce, which is good. You can reach all the way to the back. I can Blight. I don't really care for that. More Blighting. So, uh, I don't have Impale. Hmm. 
I might use her. How about this guy? Mm. I can stun. I got a couple good stuns. I got some bleeds, which are really not any good in the ruins. But I, I should take him instead. Uh, yeah, let's see if we can give it a try. As long as we have the Vestal. I'm hoping I get another Vestal. Because they level up really fast. And, um, well, at least for me, they do. And pretty soon I can't take them on the lower missions. So I need like three or four Vestals. <laughs> you know what? Here's what we're going to do. Let's go back and get the other Plague Doctor. I can always dismiss him if I don't need him. What better laboratory than the blood-soaked battlefield? Fresh kegs, cards, and curtained rooms promise solace to the weary and broken alike. A thousand? Let's have Garen. The cobwebs have been dusted. Meditate. The set straight. The Abbey calls to the faithful. Okay. And do I want to finish? You know what? Maybe I might wait till next time to do this one. Because I'm at almost 40 minutes now. I think I will. I'm going to leave this episode here, and then we come back. Because, you know, the beginning, the first episode is always this, you know, we have to talk about it and go through the intro and all that stuff. So, uh, next episode will start right away on the second week, and I, I'm hoping to do two weeks then. Um, so, we'll, we'll start, we'll embark right away and go on that mission, and then do the second one. Thanks for joining me on this first episode, and I hope you'll enjoy the series. Like I said, the uh, I understand that Darkest Dungeon 2 is out and everybody's watching that. Whatever. They can watch that. I'm more interested in this game, and I hope you are as well. At least the people who are watching. So, thanks. I'll see you next time.